Today, I am going to show you how to add a different picture in your, uh, your little picture here for your course. And I'm going to show you how to do it through Canva, which I find a little less confusing than using um, a Google Doc or a Google Slide. The first thing I'm going to do is I've created an account in Canva. I use a free account right now, and I just signed in with whatever Gmail you want. And I'm going to go create a design right here, or you can use, you can scroll through and, and look, but I'm going to create a design and I'm going to use the logo. This is, um, a space where you can design your own logo if you want, or you can go over here and you can kind of search templates that you like. And there are a lot of free ones. There are some that aren't free, but there are a lot of free ones to choose from. So I'm gonna scroll through and let's say, I don't know, I wanna use, I don't know, I don't see any I love actually. Let's see, I'm gonna scroll up. And maybe I just want to use this one. Look, it has a book. And so um, you can highlight the text. I'm going to hit Control A. And I'm going to type example course. And then I'll type Martinez. Obviously, that's too big. I hit Control A. And I'm going to make it way smaller so that it all fits. And boom, I can change the background color if I want. Kind of click around, you can do a custom color. I like navy, that looks good to me. Perfect. So let's say I wanted this one. Now this one's pretty simple. There were a whole lot of other ones. There's also some elements that you can add to it if you want, like little stickers. Like you can kind of custom create your own logo, you can add your own text, your own backgrounds, and so on and so forth. But for the sake of this video, I'm just going to go with this kind of basic one. And then I'm going to click download. And um, the file type I have chosen is a PNG high quality image. It's what is, was suggested. So that's just what I went with. And then I'm going to click download and it's going to save to my computer. And just you can name it whatever you want, click save, just remember where you saved it to. Go and X out of that. And then I'm gonna go, this is an example course that I created. And you know, usually it gives you kind of a boring picture right here. So you're gonna hover over that, you're gonna click edit picture, attach file, and then you're gonna search for the one that you wanted. And then you're gonna click open. X out and boom, there you go. You have a new pretty picture. And when the kids see it, when they open up their courses, it's right here. So it looks really nice and neat. So that is how one way you can um, change your course picture through Canva and really have a lot of options on how to make it look the way you want.